There we go. Happy Friday, everybody. Are you here? <laughs> oh, <laughs> Tony says, talk because I can't hear anything. How about now? Kathy says, I can't hear. I think we're good now. Let me see. Microphone looks like it's doing, doing good. I got good levels. Happy Friday, everybody. Huh? Jessica said, yay. I think that means you can see me or hear me. All right, good, good. All right, hello, everybody. Hi, Kathy. All right, good deal. All right, how about YouTube? Can you hear me now? I've got a really cute project for you guys. How do you like that Be My Valentine bundle from the new catalog? I'm loving this new catalog. There's way, way, way too much oh, good stuff in it. Well, is there such a thing as too much good stuff? Got a cute little treat for you today. I think it's a good Valentine for all ages, but it does lend itself well, even though it's cute. I think for um, your you know more, more mature Valentine recipients, I think it's the honey treat that makes it kind of more suitable for an adult taste. Super simple, very fast. You can bust these out in no time. I hope that you like them. Hey, Sonia, thank you for sharing. Oh goodness, you guys are the best. Thanks for sharing. <laughs> Tony says, I'm having some hot tea while watching. Oh, I could go for that. Freezing Pennsylvania, huh? It's sunny and freezing here too. I'm telling you, I'm glad that I'm not outside right now. All right, let's get, um, I want to just do a little bit of housekeeping. I want everybody to get in here because I want you guys to hear it as much as we can live, but I wanted to give you some um, housekeeping and updates on our card club. Our card club for cool people build for the very first month last night and to everybody who helped us make it a smashing success i am so grateful so if you are a card club member one of the founding card club members you will have seen um, or will see when you take a look your subscription build to your card they build at 3 a.m so this is my first one i'm not sh exactly sure when it was going to bill but i knew on the fifth so they are billed and now we get to work producing the content for you, making the kits for those of you who joined us at the to-go level or the concierge level. We are, uh, product is all ordered and we are scrambling to make your kits. We'll get the videos done and, or the video done and the PDF done for you. Um, our schedule will be the fifth of the month will bill and the 20th of the month will be the shipping date and the class will open on the 20th of the month so what will happen now for our card members you'll get in pretty short order another email and the email will invite you to the um, secret page where the class will be held this class is not a public class it is um you can you can get the content online we will be adding the online content to the store for 24.95 you can subscribe online only for 22.95 a month if you want to just pick and choose your subscriptions it's slightly higher but this is not a public class so it's going to be in an email um, for you to get to that page all right so that's the next thing to look out for if you missed out don't don't be sad. The next thing we do is after we produce the class, we will add it to the store as a product that you can purchase. And we will be taking subscriptions starting now for February. So if you missed on January, don't worry, we're gonna have just as much fun in February. So thank you everybody for making it such a spectacular hit and such a success. So that is um, our card club for cool people update. <laughs> um, and let's see here our next class will be announced by email to our subscribers the last week of the month so you will get a sneak peek so you know what's coming and an email that lets you add the featured tools to your class packet so if you're wondering what's coming next whether you're subscribed or not the end of the month last week of the month you'll get that information after we email our subscribers with their sneak peek, then we'll post 
the sneak peek of February's class packet. So you can, guys can expect to see that information, um, sneak peek, let me look at a calendar here just to, um, the week of the 22nd. So we'll probably get there in like the, the, the 24th, 25th, somewhere in the week of the 27th, um, we will post publicly our sneak peek for next month's kit. All right. <laughs> um, Stacy says, do we have to sign up every month? It is a subscription. It's a reoccurring. Um, the card club is reoccurring every month on the fifth. It'll automatically, uh, bill you for the subscription. Now you can go into your settings and cancel at any time, but it is a subscription. And the reason for the subscription based so that you guys know, I've said this before is that we could not predict how many kits to make. And we were ending up sometimes with 20 extra kits. And what do you do with 20 extra kits? Well, I was doing a song and dance to move them. And so the subscription will let us know approximately leading up to that fifth of the month when it's billed, how many kits we need to make. All right, so that was the number one reason why we went to subscription. But yes, it is a subscription service. You will be reoccurringly billed on the fifth of the month. We don't bill any other day. So if you sign up, say tomorrow, um, you will not see any charge on that card that you used until February 5th, okay? So good question. If you stay for six consecutive months, it also works kind of like a host co or a hostess club. So those of you who subscribe this month, our founding mem members, if you stay for six consecutive months in June, you're gonna get a swag bag with $25 in product as my thank you gift. We're incorporating kind of a host code um, or a host club into this card club. So, and the, that's for our to-go and concierge levels. They get the swag bag. You, our information, product, our online class, online only, does not get the swag bag. All right, so the swag bag is for our kits. But you don't wanna, you won't wanna, you won't wanna miss a month because six consecutive months you're gonna get a great swag bag worth of product. But you can come and go as you please. And when you log in at Kitchen Table Stamper, on the left hand side is subscriptions, and that's where you can manage your subscription. Turn it on, turn it off whenever you want. Does that help? <laughs> Um, Stacey says, will you make any extra kits? I am planning on making very few extra kits because um, that's, that's the whole point of the subscription. I will probably make two a month, but don't count on them because some, sometimes what happens, I'm realizing, and I'm very new to subscriptions, but a credit card will fail. I'll run a report. There won't be somebody on there. 12 hours later, it'll retry their credit card. It'll go, and then that's mostly why I'm making an extra kit or two. Good questions, I love your questions, thank you guys. All right, so this month is eight cards. Um, if you're signed up for the package, you'll get it. If you still want the information product, it will be available to purchase for $24.95 after the 20th of the month when we've um, shipped and delivered content to club members, okay? All right, so good questions and thank you everybody. It's been such a smashing success. All right, hey Leah, how are you? <laughs> Leah says you find the most original treats. Where do you find the honey sticks? Oh, these are from Amazon, I love it. I got a bag of 100 of them. And they're awesome in tea. If you love honey, they're just awesome. They come in, I don't know how many flavors. I got the clover, but you can get blackberry and apple and lemon and there's a, a link in the description. I love these, they're really, really, delicious and they're fun if you're a tea drinker these are kind of fun but they're also just tasty oatmeal they're good for oatmeal too they're good for taking if you if you pack a lot of meals you know you take your your tea and your honey it's really easy to take that for lunch or for your break um, if you if you pack a lot of meals these are great too but they make really really cute treats don't they <laughs> um, let's see Kathy said happy Friday happy Friday everybody hi Nancy hi Jan Hi, Deepa. Deepa says, what a cute treat. And so super easy. So this is it. We're celebrating the launch of our card club for cool people Cool people with a coordinating treat. So a nice, simple treat that you can make to match your cards. And let's worky-talky, I think. I'm going to catch up on... <laughs> Lisa says, of course, go to Amazon. Oh, I can't even. I love it. How much did they cost on Amazon? I just looked this morning. I think $19 for 100 sticks, $20 for 100 sticks. So not too bad. Uh -uh. Anne says, love the bees. Me too. I just can't get enough. 
All right, let's take a peek. How are we doing over on our YouTube comments? Hey, Jackie. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, let's see here. Yeah, oh, Jackie cuts my class packets. Jackie, Katie, um, my Aunt Mare, and Rhonda, and myself. It's like a really big team effort. But Jackie says a real number real is really helpful when we're die cutting things like bows. <laughs> it can get tricky with just to get out of the die. <laughs> And there's like 300 of each one, 394 if I recall correctly. And that was earlier when we didn't have quite as many packets to make even. Don't worry, Jackie, we're gonna have a real number for you guys now. Oh, all right, good morning, Deborah. Uh, good morning, Teresa. Hello, everybody. All right, let's... <laughs> Josette says, hello, everyone from Netherlands. Well, welcome. I'm glad you're here. All right, let us do a little tiny bit of product recap here because Be My Valentine has some really fun um, product coordinations that I just want to point out to you really quick so that you can see what I see. All right, so fluffiest friends and the radiating stitches dies or what i used here radiating stitches is the little circle tag you get two circles in this of course my circle is buried i used the bigger one and so just wanted to show you guys that it's an online exclusive you can go to marissaalvarez.stampinup.net click shop click menu click products click online exclusives to see these the other one that you might or might not recognize is this awesome die from Fluffiest Friends. So at Fluffiest Friends, you can do the bundle or just the dies. The dies have really cute um, like accessory pieces that will go great with the bees. The two balloon dies, let me take this out of here. I didn't, um, the two balloon dies, really, really cute with the bee. There's a little beehive, a branch, lots of leaves, grass, really good little um, wingman die set for your bee. We are gonna use this one for our hive today. All right, so those are our product coordinations I wanna point out. Oh, one more that I wanna show you just in case you missed this one. Now, in the annual catalog, there is the Twisted Rope 3D embossing folder. That plus this makes the best beehive ever, right? See, can you see the Twisted Rope texture on there? And our little door is created with the double oval punch from the annual catalog. All right, so those are some product co coordinations, maybe things that you have in your collection already that really work awesome with the bees, things that we used for this project today. We're gonna start, since I got it here, with some basic black cardstock, and we're gonna cut a little door, and then we're gonna take some basic white cardstock, and we're gonna cut a little decorative trim for our door with basic white. And then I'm gonna grab my Stampin' Cotton Emboss Machine and we're gonna make a hive. This is gonna go so fast, you guys. I can't even believe it, I should slow down. Um, <laughs> Kay says, how cute, thank you. And Tony says these are adorable. Oh, I'm so glad you guys like them. I felt like, is it too simple? Maybe it's just too simple. There's no such thing as too simple when you need lots and lots and lots of Valentines, right? These are really good ones, I think, for um, the ladies at the office or to just bring in to, um, to work, to bring into the, you know, the, the, the senior center, the ladies at the library, you know, all the fun adult people in your life. Um, you can give them little Valentines. And I think these little honey sticks do lend themselves well to um, you know, spread in some, some cheer among adults. All right, we're gonna first cut our little beehive. So let me get my Daffodil Delight cardstock. I got a scrap and my little beehive and we're gonna give it a crank. Um, this is gonna be a two-step process. We're gonna, well, really two, because we're gonna cut and then we're gonna texture and then we're going to add a little ink to highlight that embossed texture. So. First, now we're gonna switch out from two, three, and three. We need four. Got our little beehive. And that's a cute beehive, right? But it's gonna be even better when we do it up with the twisted rope. Tony says simple is good for some projects, especially when you're making lots of them. Exactly, and so this is the one. 
get a hundred honey sticks and you can make these up really fast, right? Oh, Donna, thank you for sharing. Hey, Carol, happy Friday. <coughs> oh, pardon me, I'm sorry. I'm still getting over this sick. I have been oh, so, I got, I got pretty sick, you guys, like in bed sick. I don't usually get in bed sick. I spent the whole New Year holiday in bed. <coughs> now I'm talking too much and it's stirring everything up. All right, look at that. Is that not like the wow factor or what? So simple. All right, now let's slide this out of here and we're gonna do some ink on the edges. Darn that Jackie Anderson. Now I have to open the computer to laugh at her on YouTube, right? She is over there, but she did have a good point. She's the one who, um, she and Katie, um, Rhonda and, and my aunt, we cut these packets and it takes a, it takes quite a bit of um, preparation and they really do. They're like, Marissa, how many are we making? And Marissa says, I don't know, what do you think? Now we, we have our subscribers. We will definitely um, have a better, easier time of, <laughs> of, of deciding that. Um, where did I put my, this? Okay, what you wanna do with this, <clears throat> oh, thank you, you wanna, Tap off, I don't know, I got, it got really dark here. So do as I say, not as I do. Tap off, otherwise you get that like thumbprint on your project. Swipe, you're gonna go um, horizontal with your paper, horizontal with your brush, about an inch into the hive. So you can see we're starting to get some um, highlights here and some shadows. It's really bringing out the texture of that twisted rope. If you want to ink the front of something like this, like highlight it with a texture with ink, or if you want to, you know, drag kind of um, make a vintage, then you do horizontal. If you just want to ink the edge to, you know, define the edge, then you go vertical. You see, so that's the difference. You have more of a vertical. The brush is. Um, perpendicular to the paper so you're pulling down vertical and so we can do that and we can get a nice um, defined edge on this beehive but if we want to really show off the texture then you go horizontal so just a little tip for using your blending brush for this kind of a project and now look at that we've got not just the texture but the highlights and the um, I don't know that, what is that? Just that def definition around the edges really brings some, makes it 3D. We've got our little doors and our treat here. This is, I can't even believe how fast this is going. Um, Robin Wilson says, what is the subscription charge per month? All right, good question. I can glue, I'm gonna glue this one to this one and then I'm gonna glue them both to this one and trim off the bottom. So as I do that, I'll tell you. So the Card Club for Cool People has three levels of subscriptions. There's $22.95 and that's for the online content. That's for the crafter that has it all. You get no kit, you get no laminated card sketch, you get no swag bag, you just get the PDF, the videos. Now every month there's an exclusive sketch for cool people and the exclusive sketch for cool people won't be shared anywhere else. You get that one in PDF form at the first level at that $22.95. For $44.95 you get everything that the online only get so you get the PDF the videos you get the um, sketch PDF the exclusive sketch and you also get a class packet now every month we're gonna do at least six cards but this month's a month it's eight it'll just depend on how it works out this one also has a wonder recipe component beside the sketch and so you get the class packet to do the cards at least six of them at least and $20 worth of product, at least $20 worth of product. So this time we're getting a half a pack of the um, Be Mine designer series paper, a spool of the ribbon, and a full package of the hearts and flowers adhesive. So you'll get $20 worth of product. 
Now, then there's the concierge level, and that's $46.95. That includes the class packet, the $20 worth of product, the um, PDF, the videos. It includes the um, sketch PDF and a printed laminated sketch that you can put into your binder. So if you're somebody who's collecting those sketches, you'll want that concierge level for that. So those are the three levels. Um, and you can just, when you click the subscribe, there's a little drop down menu and you pick which level you want to subscribe at. I can't find my half inch circle punch, so we're gonna stamp inside. <laughs> I was gonna punch the holes in here, but as I shift things, I'll probably come across it. So let me put this aside and we're gonna get some ink pads and Stampin' Paris Matt, very, very good question. If you join now, you'll be signed up for February. Um, and let's see here, I got some Daffodil Delight again. And Memento. Pam, thank you for sharing. From sunny, cool North Carolina. It's just cold here, it's not cool. <laughs> uh, let's see here. Robin said, perfect, one last question. When do you have to be signed up by for this month? This month is past, it builds last night. And if you sign up today, you will be signed up for February and that will bill overnight, very, very early in the morning on February 5th. Now, if you've missed the um, subscription for this month, don't fret, we are gonna have the online class in the store later this month, and I will post when it's all ready. Okay, good questions, thank you. With a new um, program like this, I really appreciate the questions. Uh, it helps everybody to kind of have an opportunity to get more familiar with the things that have changed. Some things have stayed the same, like our card classes, um, it's gonna be very much like a stamp a stack packet. We're stamping the wings with pool party, first generation for the outline. And we're going to stamp the inside of the wings, second generation with pool party. So the packet that you receive as a card club member is gonna be very similar to what you've been used to as if you followed our stampa stacks the difference is is you're going to have an exclusive sketch so at least one of the designs will be around that sketch and the um, difference is that the stampa stack class won't be on the blog it is exclusive content for cool people our subscribers our card club for cool people so that's those are the primary differences um, oh and then the the subscription works kind of like the host club. So if you're familiar with like that rotating host benefits, every class packet has $20 worth of product in it. So we've decided that we're gonna spread out among our to-go subscribers and our concierge su subscribers, um, the host benefits. So you get a swag bag if you stay for six consecutive months. So those are the three difference from the um, stamp -a stack that you have been used to. All right, love you on the tag with black. Now let's get our B body. Oh, and you guys know, I always say, make sure you got your punch handy so that you can see if where you're stamping on the paper is going to line up easily when you go to put it in the punch, right? We don't wanna do any punch gymnastics. So we got our Daffodil Delight for the body. Um, Dolores is Hello, I'm finally tuning in. I've been busy making one of your old projects, Snowman Soup. Oh, the weather for that is coming. I heard we're gonna have like six inches of snow on Tuesday. Oh, I don't like it. <laughs> All right. Um, oh, Nancy said, that's why I'm confused. You said until the fifth to order. Now it's the by the fourth. No, it's, it is the fifth bills. So I didn't know when it would bill based on my new subscription service, but it bills on the 5th at the at, at three o'clock in the morning is when it bills. So that's why yesterday through everything, I was like, today's the last day. Email said, today's the last day because I didn't know what time it would bill on the 5th. So yeah, yeah, the 4th is the last day. I mean, if you get it in at one o'clock in the morning on the 5th, you, you'll be fine, but it has to be before the subscription bills, but I didn't know that time. So yesterday I spent a lot of effort posting today was the last day and emailing today was the last day. I'm so sorry that it was not
clear for you, Nancy. We've got a um, new service processing, and I had no idea when they'd pull it. I just knew on the 5th. I was um, prepared for it to pu pull at midnight, which is technically the 5th, right? Um, that's why I spent all day yesterday really, really pushing that. I'm so sorry. If you guys really want this month's content um, and the to-go packet, I can um, take another form of payment. Just reach out to me privately and we can arrange for another mode of payment for this month after you subscribe. So subscribe and then reach out. Let me know you want this month and I'll see if we can get you the packet for this month if you really, really want to get in there. All right, I've got Poppy Parade Hearts. I've got my wings, my little bee body. I did not do his face yet, but we're gonna come back to that in a minute. I'm going to do his antennas. Um, oh no, I didn't pay attention to my punch. That's gonna be so hard to punch. I know that I need to stamp this upside down. I'm just gonna stamp them again. Hold on. When you stamp anything to punch out with a little punch, the little heart, stamp it upside down so that you can get into your punch easier. So let me get my little heart again. My hearts are Poppy Parade. You can use Sweet Sorbet too, because the ribbon is Sweet Sorbet. So stamp that one upside down. All right, let's do some of these punches so we can see where we've got room for one more heart. <laughs> Joseph said it's January 5th over there. Yes, it is. We live in the past. Is it January 5th over there? Or are you guys already on to the 6th? From most places, uh, United States, we live in the past. Oh, man. Okay, let me just pop this. All right. We got one. Oh, let's see if I can get... Hmm. I don't know if I'm going to be able to get it. If I go across, I'm going to ruin one. No. You just got to stamp them upside down. See how much easier it is when you stamp them upside down? can just pop them right in there. So use the little guy for the heart, but you can also use the little guy for the antennas. I don't know. My mind was blown when I saw that I could use this little heart for the antennas. Did you guys know that? Did you see that? Or is it just me that it wasn't obvious? <laughs> I was so excited when I saw it. All right, now our little bee body. The thing about the builder punches is though, you do end up with the, the confetti. Did you guys see that one fly? <laughs> All right. Cut the card stock in half long ways. There we go. I don't have to do it. Let's see. Let's go this way. Because then, yeah, see if we cut it like this instead of stamp it again. Tony, you're brilliant. Now we stamped it upside down, right? <laughs> Let's get that one. Oh, I love my community. You guys are the best. All right. Now do we have all of our pieces? We have our hearts, we have our bee, wings, antennas, and our tag. <laughs> uh, Marion says, when will we see the project for February so we can be sure to order the stamp set punch of dice? Um, I will be, it's gonna be on kind of a regular repeat calendar. So each month in the last week of the month, you will get an email if you're a subscriber that will give you a sneak peek and the opportunity to add the tools. So you will definitely get a heads up on that. After I send that email to the subscribers, then I will make an announcement to the general public what's coming for next month for new subscribers. But you'll get that information first by email. And you will definitely have some time. You'll get the um, email this month should go about the 24th, 25th of the month, and then you will be um, billed for February on February 5th. So you can have a little bit of time to get the uh, materials or supplies or tools that you might need ordered. Okay? All right, so now we did our little bee. We can make him coming or going, which I love about this little bee. You want him to face this way, you just put him that way before you stamp his face. I'm gonna face that way. And this is like the thing right there. So we want, we're gonna do our bee going the other way this time. We're gonna make a left-handed one. <laughs> so let's get a little face for our bee. We've got the winky face here, so we're gonna use a full-on smile. There's four faces for this bee. One is the winky face, and the other one's this um, wide eyes with a smile. One's a smiley face with closed eyes. And then the other one is a mad face. <laughs> 
<laughs> I don't know how often I'll use the mad face, but it sure is cute. All right, let's get this out of there. And we need some liquid glue to assemble our bee. Um, Robin says, I'd love to get in for this month's subscription. I will definitely be subscribing and reaching out. Thank you for this last opportunity. Oh, you're welcome. I know we're changing our, um, our program around here. So we will get, we'll get you on the program. If you want to stay, if you want to be subscribed, go ahead and subscribe. You'll be all set for February. And then just send me an email. Remind me that we're going to um, make another um, method of payment and I will order the materials and get you all set, my friend. All right, so there's our little bee with wings. Uh, let's see here. I, I lost my little Facebook window, or my YouTube window. Let's get on there. <laughs> you guys are in both places. Nancy and Jackie are having a conversation. I love you guys. Uh, <laughs> Jackie says, keep talking, you'll be on longer, right? With a project like this, it's so, it's so easy to just um, bust it out so fast. But it's a good it's a good one. I knew there would be questions after the subscription, um, after the subscription build and after we you know launched this. So I did kind of plan to use the same bundle so we could talk about it. Got my 1 8 inch circle punch, punched a hole in the top of my tag. I think I have put it as long as I can without my half inch circle punch. Hang on you guys, I'm looking around to see where I put it. I cleaned up real good when I was setting up over here. It can't be that far though. It never fails, I drop things. Is it on the floor? Hey, Auntie Mary, will you go in that? Yeah, I have a um, half inch one that's the old style one, like the whale punch. Oh, it got put away. <laughs> go figure. <laughs> It got put away, and I just did the video this morning. All right, so I've got a half inch circle punch now, and we're going to go from the center top and just punch. You need to make sure that you leave enough room there so that you don't risk tearing when you're uh, putting your honey sticks. And then you're gonna go through three layers here, so it's gonna be a little squeezy. Don't pinch your hands. You know what, because there's three layers here. Let's put it down on the table and then press because we don't want to pinch our hands in between the punch, but it will go through there. Just don't hurt yourself. All right, there's our little tag. We've got some honey sticks here. The half inch circle holds two honey sticks really nicely. So we're gonna thread them from the front to the back, and then from the back to the front, and there's our little tag. <laughs> you guys, I really am like slowing down because it's so, it's so speedy. Everybody needs speedy little Valentines. All right, let's do some comments here. They're also good when you don't feel well. The honey sticks. <laughs> and honey sticks when you're not feeling well. Is that what you're telling me, Jackie? I love Wonder Recipes, and yes, I'm shouting, woohoo! Um, the Wonder Recipe from, or the Be My Valentine Stampa Stack has one design that's the new exclusive sketch, and then it's a Wonder Recipe number one, maybe, class. So um, I'm pretty excited that they turned out, they just turned out really cute. All right, we're gonna slide through from front to back. All right, now you wanna pull a nice, little length here. My cheat is to do the palm of my hand. See how I'm just past the longest finger? And that really gives you a pretty decent um, measuring device, believe it or not. Now you're gonna go from the back to the front after you wrap it around the honey. See, we're behind the honey. And then from the back to the front, you might shred your ribbon a little bit here as you're pulling it through, but don't worry. You've got plenty to make your bow. I'm gonna pull that nice and tight. Now here's the end on the spool, right? So you're gonna swoop up, or you're gonna loop up, but you don't wanna twist. Just push, swoop over the top, tuck, pull, and there you have ears up, tails down, hold the center of the knot, and you can adjust the size of the loops. 
there it is and now we have the sweetest little tag let's get some ribbon scissors buried them Robin says you're the best oh it's my pleasure you're the best I appreciate your support you have been just a such an encouragement regular support over all the years we will get you set okay says love the face right look at the look at the little angry face <laughs> I don't know I don't know how many I'm gonna uh, how many cards I'm gonna make with the little angry face but I'm glad I have it <laughs> Could you imagine? I, and the sentiment says, um, no matter what, I love you no matter what. So I guess a little angry face in cir circumstances. But isn't that hysterical? Did you guys notice the little angry face? <laughs> oh, I don't know. Love this, love this bundle. Not sure if I'll be making angry face bees or not, though. Um, where are my dimensionals? We need to dimensional this guy keep the um, dimensionals low on the wings I like to do where the wings meet the body kind of overlap that where the antenna meets the body kind of overlap that but be careful you don't want to stick it to your honey sticks and then I'll do the bottom and support the bee now I'll remove the liners pop this guy on he's gonna be going the other way which I just think is gonna be adorable they can like talk to each other and then here you want to make sure that you get your bee so that that's when you put under the antennas is stuck to the beehive and not to the honey ask me how I know <laughs> so what I'm saying I'm finding the long way around to say um, watch your adhesive placement on your little bee and then once you've got them on there what you can do is you can just lift the wings a little bit put a dimensional right on the edge of the beehive take the lead um not the what's this thing called the liner off and then stick the wings to the and now you know that you didn't go past the edge anywhere and leave anything exposed I love it. I love it. I hope you guys love it. It's not too simple. I think it's probably a good way to end catalog launch and card club launch week with a nice, simple craft, something that's fun and easy to do. You can make a bunch of them. They won't cost you a lot and definitely unique, I think. I don't have enough room, I feel. Maybe you feel differently on this you know small little canvas to use the hearts and flowers if you guys haven't seen those they're amazing but um, we do I think need a little bit of bling something something special so I'm gonna grab my Wink Estella and I'm going to add just the tiniest touch to the wings and I'll just swipe over and get a little sparkle here we go uh oh, there we go. I think I missed a spot. <laughs> That's it, you guys. Can you believe it? <laughs> um, it says, yes, but if you glue the sticks, they won't fall out. <laughs> That's a good point. Um, I have one where the sticks won't fall out. <laughs> That's so funny. Does anyone know if the honey sticks are individually wrapped? Okay, these are, um, where are these are not. So, like, they're not like a straw where they've got like a plastic or a paper wrapper on them. The actual um, plastic tube is exposed, but you just cut it and then put it into your coffee or tea. So um, I've never seen them individually wrapped, always just like this. Even like at um, tea shops and coffee shops, sometimes they'll have a right of them for you to take the ones that you want, the flavored ones. I've seen them like that, and I've never seen them individually wrapped. But if you find them, let me know. But these are, yeah, not, no sort of plastic or paper wrapper over it, like a straw. Is that what you're looking for, Donna? Um, let's see here. That's exactly it, Donna. Donna's got it right. You just snip the end and then let it drip into your tea or 
your coffee or dribble it on your oatmeal. Really good for that too. Okay, wait, we gotta get this guy back in here. He can't be all alone over there. <laughs> Are they cute? Did you like them too simple? I feel like we're done way too early today. I needed some time for housekeeping, so we went with something simple. But I think super cute, I hope you do too. Hey, Tina. All right, you guys, that was it for today. If you um, are interested in um, getting the Be My Valentine subscription, please reach out to me. Subscribe. You can um, go to the Kitchen Table Stamper store and subscribe. It's the top post on the blog and then email me and let me know that you want to be added to the list for January and we'll arrange a separate payment for January. Okay, so you'll be billed for February when you subscribe, but after you're subscribed, I'm happy to let anybody who um, missed the, the date this first time get caught up, all right? Donna said, love this, and thanks. Have a good weekend, everyone. You too. Patty says, so cute. You guys are the best. I'm glad you like it. Tia says, can't wait to watch it from the beginning. It's a quick one. I think you'll love it, though. I'll have a, a clean video and a blog post for you today. And then I'll see you guys next week. Next Friday, I'll be live. Same time, same channels. Um, we will have a challenge in the craft social. If you're not already a member in the craft social, get over there and join our community. We'd love to have you. And yeah, that's it. You guys happy new catalog and happy celebration to you. And I will see you guys next week. Kathy says, thank you. Leah says, so cute. Thank you. <laughs> All right, you guys, thank you for joining me today. And a Replay will be available instantly. I'll have a clean video for you in Project Sheet later today. Bye, guys. Have a great weekend.